Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. For today's video, I'm going to show you the PowerPoint presentation that I did for my 6th grade students in Toyota in Nagasaki Elementary School. So I used the PowerPoint presentation 365. I think this is the latest PowerPoint presentation and I just got this like three days ago in Lazada for 300 pesos. So if you're interested to get 365 PowerPoint presentation, just comment your name below and not just PowerPoint presentation, but also the Microsoft Office. All right, so let's get started. Okay, this is the PowerPoint presentation and I'm just gonna click the slideshow. All right, no, not that one. So here, so I put an audio here. Hello, my name is Dora. Do you want to go on an adventure with me? And of course, the children will answer. So yes, we do. And they have to hear this. Yes, we do. And, I'm, and then I'm going to say, Se, no? Yes, we do. Okay. And then of course, the HRT will say what yes, we do is. All right. Hello. And next is, okay, another audio here. Great. This is the map going to the Adventure Island. Let's go. All right. So this is the awesome part. This is what I really like about 365 PowerPoint presentation. You can zoom in the picture. So let's click the map. Boom. That's the thingy or that's the zoom thingy that I'm talking about. Now, there's another zoom effects here. So, let's try to look at it. So, we have three places that we need to go to. The jungle, the mountains, and the adventure island. So, boom. There you go. All right. Well, the students really enjoyed this presentation because uh, I put the plus factor which is my face <laughs> and they were all laughing so okay i have an audio here oh no we can't enter the jungle we have to answer the lord of the jungle's questions okay and of course this is the lord of the jungle and there is an audio i'm the lord of the jungle <laughs> before you enter my kingdom have to answer my questions. It's ridiculous, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, in that part, the students were laughing because I think the the laughing part bah, is really not that good. So they just laugh. So here's the question in another Zoom thingy, Zoom effects. How do you come to school? This is a review part. So how do you come to school? Then the, the students will answer, I go to school by... Taxi. I go to school by car. I go to school by bike. I go to school by subway. I go to school by bus. I go to school on foot. So they can't say I go to school by walking. All right. Native English speakers would say I walk to school or I go to school on foot. So yeah, but most of my students are walking. So I taught them how to answer the question how do you come to school so now they know that if someone asks them how do you come to school they will answer i go to school on foot all right so okay there you go and we have to check this out all right how do we go to the mountains is it a on foot b by boat and c by airplane so what do you think is the answer Okay, the answer is on foot. Very good. All right, there you go. And, okay, now this is the ice monster. And this one, the voice changer, I looked at it on the internet and I found that there is a voice changer. So, this is really awesome. I'm the ice monster. Someone stole my treasure. How dare Find my okay, so here we're going to drill the word treasure. 
So I'm just gonna make them repeat the word treasure, treasure, treasure. This one, treasure, okay? So I'm just gonna point this uh, box and uh, I'm just gonna tell them treasure. This is treasure. In Nihongo, so the, the HRT will help me. And oh, okay. And next is we have to play the three hints game. So I gave them an example. First is first hint, my treasure. First hint is black. Okay, it's black. Say no, it's black. Okay. With two hands. With two hands. Two hands. Say no. Two hands. Okay, and with numbers 1 to 12. So I'm just gonna let them um, count from 1 to 12. And I told them not to mention numbers 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, and 12. So instead of saying two, they have to say wow. So one, wow, three, wow, five, wow, seven, wow, nine, wow, eleven, wow. So it's really interest it's really interesting. So what do you think is the answer? Okay, so of course they did answer my question in Nihongo and then the HRT translated very good my treasure is this watch the treasure of the monster is watch so can you find my watch did you find it yes okay so the, the students will point <clears throat> where the watch is and there you go okay so um, at, in this part I use the the morph transition so another audio for the ice monster here thank you for helping me find my treasure before you leave the mountains i want to know your treasure what's your treasure okay thank you so before we play the three hints game they have to think of their own treasure for three minutes and think of the hints so it can be written in Nihongo, of course. So, what's your treasure? The students will answer, my treasure is this. So, example, book, computer, soccer ball, school bag, shoes, t-shirt, and so on. And another audio. You did it. Job well done. It's time for you to go. Bring these tickets. You can use it. That's not really the end of the slide, but I don't know what happened. So there is still another place that we have to go to, and that is the Adventure Island. Here in this part, in the Adventure Island, the students will play the carousel game, wherein there is an inside circle and outside circle. So they have to face each other, and they have these uh, five pieces of paper where they put the name of the treasure they, that they have and, or they can also draw the treasure and then they have to practice the sentence what is your treasure my treasure is so they have to find uh, they have to do it that's it for today you guys thank you so much for watching and this video is really intended for the teachers because as far as I'm concerned in the Philippines you are using the <clears throat> You are using the distance learning and PowerPoint presentation is really important nowadays. So you can help your students learn from you even though you're far from each other. So if you really want to know more about the PowerPoint presentation that I made and how to do it, just, just leave a comment down below and I'm going to really find some time to help you learn about the Zoom PowerPoint presentation. So there you go guys. Thank you so much for watching and again um, Shout out to all my viewers to all my students who keep watching and to all my family members who keep watching Thank you so much for your full support and I couldn't say much more now. Thank you so much for everything and uh, You take care and keep safe and stay healthy God bless y'all again. This is orange orang and Have a great day everyone